a former Nazi concentration camp guard suspected of being involved in killings while serving at the Dachau camp near Munich between 1943 and the end of the war could face murder charges following a tip-off from the Simon Wiesenthal Center. He has denied any involvement in the killings in an interview with German newspaper Bild. However, he did confess that some prisoners he reported for crimes were never seen again. He was told joining the SS would be fun. This is the site of the camp. Barbed wire fences still stand as a reminder of the more than 30,000 people who were killed, died of disease or starved there between 1933 and 1945. It became a model for the network of Nazi camps where millions of Jews and other minorities were murdered. The Simon Wiesenthal Center, an NGO that hunts down Nazis and brings them to justice, put up posters in major German cities in July of this year as part of its campaign to bring surviving Nazi war criminals to justice while they are still alive. It launched its publicity campaign under the slogan, Late but not too late. German authorities are currently investigating 30 former Auschwitz guards, according to AP News Agency. At the start of this month, former SS hitman Heinrich Bohr died in a prison hospital. He had escaped justice for six decades before being arrested in 2010. A few weeks prior to this, Erich Priebke, a former Nazi SS officer convicted of Italy's worst wartime massacre, died aged 100. He was sentenced to life in jail in 1998 for the killings of 335 civilians.